Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, we're going to explore a game-changing update to DALL-E 3 within ChatGPT that is set to transform the way we create and edit images. If you're passionate about design or just want to make your social media posts better, this update is a must-see. As you know, DALL-E 3 is only available with a paid subscription on ChatGPT. With the latest update, creating AI-generated images has become more interactive. Imagine tweaking your images right within ChatGPT with just a few clicks. Let me show you how. First, we're going to use ChatGPT 4 to create an image. Later, we'll experiment with DALL-E 3 as a GBT because it has some new added features. So, create an image of a golden retriever riding a bicycle. Golden retrievers are my favorite dogs. My dog is a golden retriever, Bruno. All right, so let's click go. All right, here we have a dog on a bicycle. Great. Now, to get to the editor interface, you need to click on the picture. So here is the interface where you can edit it. Here we have some tools that we can use to edit the pictures. So let's say we have this weird plant or tree. Let's try to remove it. So first thing you click on select and you'll get this size of the brush. Let's say we want it this big. Okay, now let's highlight this. And here we are going to write remove and click on generate. Let's see. All right, so here is the new picture. It actually removed it perfectly. All right, let's add something. So let's select and let's make the brush a little bit smaller and let's make this dog wearing glasses. So add sun glasses. All right, it did add sunglasses here, although somehow they look weird a little bit, but they are sunglasses for sure. All right, let's try the GBT. Okay, so let's go to the GBT, so DALL-E 3 here. So we'll use a similar prompt, a golden retriever, river riding a bicycle and generate. Here on the GBT, it created two images. We have some new features on this interface. If you have noticed here, we have the styles. Whenever you hover over any of them, it will just give you an example and tell you which uh, style. So you can also shuffle close up, and then here, shuffle again. We'll see this once we click on, on the editor interface, but here is something new as well. So aspect ratio, this one's square, white screen, and vertical. This one you will not see later in the editor, so you need to select this in advance. Let's say we want to change this to white screen, and then click Now it's creating an image, 16 by nine. Let's see, okay. Let's choose one of these two images. This looks closer. Let me choose this here. Now here's the interface, similar to the ones we used on ChatGPT4. Um, so let's do some edits here. Um, let's select first. Let's say we want to change the background. So let's make the brush bigger and select here. So let's select. Does it have to be perfect? All right, change the background to a school and hit generate. All right, now it changed it to a school. Here is the school, although it doesn't look perfect, Okay, 
let's say we don't like this one let's go back to the original so this was the original one let's make edits to this okay let's use some of these features down here so it says here close up let's say what happens when we click on close up all right so this is the new image it's still remembered if you notice here with the school background so when we click on this let's see it closer so this is a closer um, shot of the golden retriever the school is the background so it does make edits but i think it's not yet perfect all right let's try to add some text so let's select an area where we want the text to appear let's say we want it here and then add the text good morning and hit generate all right so this is the new generated image it did not add any text i tried this before recording this video and it did not um out of 10 times i tried it only added the text once so still we are not there in, in terms of text let's try again add the text hello and let's select an area so let's say we want it here this time and click on generate and here is again the new generated picture with no text i encourage you to try these styles here i tried many of them and they look fabulous let's do one here so why Let's look at this one here. Now let's shuffle again. Graffiti and comic book. Let's say comic book and see what happens. All right, this is interesting. So you see in this image, they it added hello in this style. And as usual, ChatGPT saves all your creations. So if we click on X here, if you scroll up, you will find all the creations if you want to go back to them or download in any of them. So there you have it, a deep dive into the incredible new features of DALI 3 within ChatGPT. The power to craft, edit, and perfect your images has never been more accessible. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe for more content just like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.